Hello everyone, welcome back to another quick CapCut tutorial. In this one, I'm gonna show you how to get rid of background noise, any kind of noise, and we're gonna do it for free. And I'm not talking about a little hum or a little hiss, I'm talking about industrial grade, seriously annoying background noise. Let me give you an example, and then let me show you what it turned into. Here we go at the beginning of this one. Take a listen to this. Oh yeah, what's up guys? It's Curse Pipe. My friends call me Big C. So this has an industrial grade machine in the background, plus a wind tunnel effect at the same time over top of my voice all combined into one audio track. We're going to turn that into this. Oh yeah, what's up guys? It's Curse Pike. Pop rates, call me. That is going to be what we get as our end result and we're not going to do any paid upgrade completely free. Let me show you how to do it. All right, so step one, I'm going to delete everything on the timeline and I'm just going to start off. I'm going to delete this audio here and we're going to start with the video. Put the video on your timeline and take a listen so you know that I've got the same one. Oh okay, yeah, what's up guys? It's Curse Pipe. My friends call me. Pretty bad. Okay, fair enough. Now, we got to separate this audio and the video. So the next step is I'm going to click on the video track in the timeline. Then I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to extract the audio. And when you do that, you're going to see here that the audio is all on one track. So everything in there is baked together. If they were on separate tracks, like the, all of the different things are on different tracks, this would be a whole lot easier, but it's not. So it's pretty difficult. Okay, we've got that done. Now, the next step is I'm actually going to move this audio out. So I'm going to move it over here. And the reason why is because I'm going to go ahead and delete the video component. So once I've done that, I'm going to click on delete. Now, watch this. If I do that again and I have the audio underneath the video and I just click on delete video, it deletes everything. So this is a weird little kind of a glitch in uh, CapCut. So again, move the audio out over to here, then click on the video, delete it. This will bring the audio back to the beginning. Now we're going to go up here and we're going to export this audio track because we're going to put this in a free AI tool called AI uh, Podcast Enhance by Adobe. It's completely free, costs nothing. So we're going to go up here to File. We're going to go to Export. And then when we get to the export, instead of having it selected on video, which is by default, I believe, or it may have video and audio, depending on your settings, we want to uncheck video and we're going to make sure that audio is checked. And under format, I like MP3, but if you prefer WAV or any other format, go nuts. But I'm going to go with MP3, and then I'm going to go ahead and call this um, really bad audio. <laughs> and then I'm just going to export it to my desktop. So I'm going to hit export. I'm going to come back when that's done. Oh, it's already done. Piece of cake. Okay, so we've exported the MP3. Now I'm going to click on open folder, and there it is. We have bad audio, and we've got really bad audio. Now, I'm going to show you how to do the AI component. It takes just a few seconds. All right, for the AI component, this is a free tool from Adobe. Costs nothing again. All I'm going to do here is click on sign in. And then when I sign in, I'm going to sign in with my uh, Google account. Now, I want to state up front here that I do not, I am not using a paid account. This is a, this is a free account. And if I wanted to upgrade, I could. I have a paid account, but it's not this one. So this is the free account version. Then under here, you'll see here something called Enhanced Speech. Just click on it. It opens it up. And then all you got to do here is choose the file. We called ours, what, really bad audio? Yeah, I think really bad audio. Click on Open. It's now going to go ahead and adjust it right out of the box. You don't have to touch any buttons. I'll come back when it's done. Then I'll show you the next and final step in CapCut. All right, job is done. It took about 30 seconds or so. And you'll see here... That enhanced speech is set to on, and all I got to do is click on download. And once it's done that, it goes into my download folder. I can just go click on that folder, and let's see where it is. Okay, really bad audio enhanced. That's the one we want. So I'm going to go back into CapCut. I'll just click on OK here. We've already exported it. And then I'm just going to drag and drop that enhanced file back in just like this. Now let's get rid of all of that stuff on the timeline. And the final step is done in CapCut. Super simple. I'm going to grab the original audio and video right here. So the original video What's up, guys? with the terrible audio, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to right click on it again. I'm going to extract the audio. Then I'm going to grab the new audio and I'm going to put it directly underneath it. So now all of them are stacked on each other. And then all you got to do now is delete the middle piece, which is the bad audio. And now listen to what we got. Oh, yeah. What's up, guys? It's Curse Pike. Pop rates call me Banksy. Back in action. It's pretty much perfect. 
It costs nothing. You don't have to go and upgrade. You don't have to pay for anything, guys. That's how you do it using CapCut. Thanks for watching.